He's able to eat this entire sandwich without throwing up. I'll give him $10,000. All right, people, what's up? Today, I found arguably one of the best Darman videos I have ever seen. YouTuber is exposed for fake giveaways. He lives to regret it, Darlo Main. I don't know, Freddy, that's, that's a lot of snakes. Bro, don't worry, it's all good. Plus, they're my neighbors. He said they're totally harmless. I mean, what is the worst that could happen? I'm gonna keep it a buck with you, buddy. I don't think your neighbor likes you. I'm sorry, if you bring me the Crayola crown box of a bunch of snakes in a pit, I'm not trusting your fucking ass. If I'm gonna believe anything, I think the neighbors probably bought the snakes to fucking assassinate you. Judging from the title, you're already a piece of shit. Aside from somebody being strangled and stuff, that is... Yo, there's Ryan. Be cool, okay? Hey, guys. Hey, Ryan. Ready to win some cash? I... Uh, I think so. You didn't say anything about snakes. Don't worry about that, okay? Focus on the 10K, okay? Of course, buddy. Focus on the $10,000, which is gonna be the same 10 grand that you're gonna pay with your hospital bill. Except the plot twist is that the 10K doesn't even fucking exist. Dustin, camera set? Okay. Hey guys, it's Freddy all day, and in front of me, I have a pool full of creepy and very crawly snakes. If you sit in the pool for 30 seconds, I'll give you $10,000. All you have to do is sit down and I'll start the timer as soon as you walk in. You know, sitting in a pit of snakes doesn't sound like a bad idea. But you see that red motherfucker, the one that looks like Satan's foreskin? I'm not getting near that fucking Twizzler, even with 10 grand on the line. My doctor bill will not cover the damages that little shit can do. Okay. Uh... All right, your time starts now. Uh, so I, I just sit down? Just take a seat. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god! <laughs> They're crawling up his legs! <laughs> How much longer? Oh. oh, what the fuck is that? He's venomous. Not that bad. Only 10 seconds to go. What is that? That bad me. 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. <laughs> You've done it. Congratulations, and as promised. $10,000! You know, this kid is very lucky that I wasn't the kid sitting in the pit. Even if a snake hissed at me, motherfucker, I will be turning your fucking ass into a baboon. <laughs> what can I say? I thought it was gonna get bit, but it's worth it now. I wouldn't want that to happen. I mean, that wouldn't be bad for views, actually. I mean, if you want to get your channel Thanos snapped for fucking violence and self-harm, then by all means. Dude's really thinking he can get by on YouTube by uploading self-harm to his channel. What's next, fucking ISIS beheading roleplay? <laughs> that video's gonna get us like a million subscribers. What if a big YouTuber hey, sees it? This is snake escaping. What if Dar Mizzle sees it? Motherfucker just said Dar Mizzle. Is that what you call Darman when you beat your fucking meat to him? Oh, Dar Mizzle! Oh, fuck off. It's Freddy, and today's challenge is full of all the nasty foods. And here with me is Alex. If he's able to eat this entire sandwich without throwing up, I'll give him $10,000. Darn, man, what the fuck is this video quality? How do you go from this 4K high-end shit where I can literally see the pubes inside of my fucking chin, and then I get this video quality? He looks like a fucking chocolate mousse. This guy looks like a used Band-Aid. Like, seriously, Darman, I'm sure you got a better budget than this. Are you up for the challenge? Uh, not really, but for this much cash, I, I guess. Perfect. Ironically, the issue I have with this photo isn't even the worms. It's the fact that this smartass put cheese on the sandwich thinking it'll taste better. Like, dumb fuck really thought that would enhance the flavor. Let's do it. Bone appetit. Oh, disgusting. Come on, man. You're really gonna have a little sandwich get in between you and all that cash? This exact frame is describing the face I am making throughout this entire video. Don't think about the $10,000, motherfucker. You better think about your reputation. 10 grand only gets you so far, pal. I cannot fucking believe it. Not the fact that he's eating the sandwich. This caption right here. Oh my gosh, guys. He's eating a bunch of fucking worms. Comment down below if you agree. Please boost my fucking interactions. Please give me fucking money. I don't think I can finish this whole thing. That's fine. 
Trust me, you won't get any of that cash. Can somebody go to Home Depot and get me some wood? I'm about to crucify this motherfucker upside down. I mean, he's wearing a cross on his shirt. This only foreshadows the shit I'm about to do to him. <laughs> You really have to appreciate the Darman ASMR. If the point of this ASMR is to disgust the viewer, then you have me beat. I'm out here recoiling like a nutsack that just got introduced to the winter breeze. That is disgusting. As promised, $10,000. Another day, another 10k. Come get these coins. That's right, bitches. Another day, another scam. I'll be honest, I have no idea how any of these people are trusting these two fellas to begin with. Trusting a guy that records a video on his iPhone saying he's giving you $10,000, that's a fucking hoax and a half. And also, we can't ignore the fact that he maybe lives in a middle class home, he wears clothes that look like they're from fucking Goodwill, the video quality looks like a fucking Bigfoot sighting. Do any of the stars not align with these kids? Bruh, look at that subscriber count. 500k. So you're telling me he got 500k from 3.5 million views in 3,000 watch hours. Well, I'm doing something fucking wrong with my channel. I got 8 million views and I got 100k. Okay, seriously, jokes aside, look at the watch hours. Darman was so lazy with the Photoshop, he forgot to put the comma in the 3,000. I absolutely love it, Darman. The production only goes up. How are you paying all these kids? You barely have enough money to afford Robux. Listen, that's for me to know and for you to- Your mom let me in. I need to talk to you. What's up, Bri? You seem upset. I am upset. I've been calling you for weeks. I can't cash my check. <laughs> oh, I can't breathe. You actually thought that I had $10,000 and I would give it to you? <laughs> Yeah, because that's what you said you were going to do. Listen, buddy, I know Stranger Things taught you that friends don't lie, but that's also a fucking lie. In the real world, ladies and gentlemen, it's every man and woman for herself and himself. AKA, fuck you and fuck your $10,000. I just had to pull a snakes for that money. Bro, that was for YouTube. Get out of here. This is really messed up. I thought you were cool. Don't hate the player, hate the game. I mean, what the kid is saying is kind of facts. I got people talking shit to me saying that my Roblox thumbnails weren't actually in the video. Motherfucker, are you pissed that I didn't satisfy your dick urges? No, dumb fuck, it was for the video. Hate the game, not the player. So we're scamming people now. You should know that there's not a shortcut to success. Bro, what's the big deal? Other YouTubers do it all the time. Yeah, because they actually have the money to back it up. This is fraud, Freddy. It's gonna catch up with you. Listen, bro. We'll worry about that later, okay? Right now, my YouTube page is growing, and once I start making money, then maybe I'll pay people. Maybe you might start paying people. That doesn't sound very reassuring. Now, this is the part of the video where you definitely could hate the player. If you're gonna be a greedy shit about scamming people, then yeah, fuck you. You smell it? What are you talking about? I don't smell anything. That's the smell of money being made. Now come on, let's go. I'll show you my next YouTube video idea. Look, if you want me to be your cameraman, then you have to figure out whatever this is. Hello? Wait, are you serious? You're not gonna believe what this is. Yeah. Okay, go ahead, Darman. Your manager gave me your number. I've been seeing your videos blow up on YouTube. Congrats. Holy shit, are we about to get a Darman feature in this video? Ladies and gentlemen, if you saw my boxers, you would think it's a fucking Harry Potter tent. Hey, Freddy, what's going on, man? It's nice to meet you. You too. I'm glad this all worked out. I was supposed to collab with Mr. Beast today, but I didn't feel like flying in North Carolina. So I canceled, cleared up my schedule. You know Jimmy too? I didn't even know that. Yeah, Sniper Wolf too, and a lot of other YouTubers. They all want to collab with me right now. This guy really got 500K on YouTube and thought he's the fucking shit on the block. I mean, in a few minutes, he's going to be the fucking shit on the pavement. I mean, this guy's got all the properties of shit. He's going to be thrown against the wall real soon and he's going to stick. Gosh, that's crazy. Yeah, you're blowing up right now. I'm seeing your stuff everywhere. Thanks. It took a lot of hard work. And money, of course. Yeah, I can imagine, because you give away a lot of money in your videos, right? So I was thinking, for our collab, it'd be cool if we did some kind of a challenge video 
last to leave a school bus wins $10,000. And if I win, I'll donate the money to charity. But if you win, you could do whatever you want with my money. I love how Darman just puts himself on the biggest pedestal here. That's right, baby. If I win, I will donate it all to charity. Oh, Darman, you fucking saint. Hey guys, before we get started with this collab, something just came to my attention. Okay. A new YouTube video just came out and it's called Freddy All Day is a Fraud. Hi, my name's Ryan. This is Alex and Tariq. You may recognize us from Freddy's videos. We completed challenges to win $10,000. Except, we never got paid one cent. They're lying! And they don't have any proof! We even have proof. You actually thought that I had $10,000 and I would give it to you? Ah, motherfucker just got exposed. You smell it? You smell that stinky shit in the air. Yeah, and that's called bitch getting exposed. That's right, bro, Chacho. You just got fucked in the ass. Can you actually just give us a minute? Is that all right? Yeah, thanks. Look, Freddy, you seem like a good kid, but you can't cheat your way to the top. You have to work hard to get there. There are no shortcuts on the road to success. But other YouTubers give away money. How am I supposed to compete with that? Are you fucking stupid? I'm gonna let you guys know, audience, when I started YouTube, I didn't have a fucking setup that costed $15,000. I started off with a fucking headset and a laptop that cost like a hundred bucks. Now that shit is what brought me to my $15,000 setup. Motherfuckers believe we start off with this shit. Now fuck off. It takes time. I mean, you think that I had a studio with sets and this big team overnight? When I first started, I had no money and I was making videos on my living room couch. But I put in the work and slow by slow, it became successful. Don't rush the process. Just put in the hard work and eventually you'll get there. You know? You're really good at this motivational stuff. Oh, uh, that's gotta be the worst line in this entire video. You can tell Darman wrote that down thinking, yeah, yeah, you know what? I am a great fucking motivational speaker. The best one ever. Anyways, audience, I've seen enough bullshit today. Please click the video on screen. I promise you'll love it. But anyways, yeah, subscribe.